Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Texas Model Home Tours. I'm your host, Alex Piak with Evolve Real Estate Group. Today, we are in Winsong Ranch and we're gonna be touring this beautiful model home with Tradition Homes. This is their 5541 model plan. It is a one-story home, just under 3,600 square feet. It is a three bedroom, three full and one half bath home. It does have a home office. It does have an awesome killer media room, three car tandem garage, a sitting hearth room, Room. very cool and what I love most about this is there is a ton of options to flex this home out all the way to a five bedroom home the base price as of today is about nine hundred and ten thousand dollars now the model home we're gonna look at today does have the additional bonus room second story that adds about thirty thousand dollars and again that upgrade price is always subject to change so make sure you check back with us but as of today it's about a thirty thousand dollar upgrade what's really cool is you could do that upgrade along with an additional bedroom upgrade for around $50,000, which makes this home about 4,200 square feet. As is today is about 4,000 square feet. And with that upgrade, it's gonna put you somewhere at about $950,000. Starting price before lots, before design and anything like that. Again, model homes, you always wanna factor easily 150 to $250,000 in upgrades, just to give you an idea with the tile, the backspace, Flash, the cat. They really trick these homes out. But again, this awesome floor plan starts at about $910,000. And for that price, for this quality of build in Winsong Ranch, really unbelievable. So let's get started with today's model home tour. Let's go check it out. Hey everybody, welcome inside the 5541 model home with Tradition Homes here in Winsong Ranch. We're taking a view back to the front door here so you guys can get a better feel for the layout here as you walk in you've got your home office currently located to the right front portion of the home we've got nice glass doors there with some beautiful built-ins currently being used by the sales team so we're not going to disturb them now off to the left here you have one of your three bedrooms on the main level here what's nice about all bedrooms here in the current plan is these are all on suite bedroom so each bedroom is going to be very good size and each one featuring a full bath option <clears throat> one of the things to note with this specific floor plan is all of the versatility that you have here this plan while we're showing today is a three bedroom home you could flex this out to as many as five bedrooms so lots of options. So here in our guest room, you see this beautiful, well-appointed bathroom. We've got the seamless glass doors with the stand-up shower, that nice herringbone, larger, almost looks like a little bit of a wood design as it accents that wall with the white ceramic tile. Nice, large walk-in closet with lots of built-ins. So you see your shelving units. We do have up to three levels of hanging rods built in. Good size vanity with lots of countertop space. You see the amount of natural light that comes in here from the front of the house with these two large windows. We've got nice, tall ceilings. We've got solid core wood doors, oversized trim. Outside of this bedroom here, you do have an additional closet, nice coat closet with some storage and a hanging rack. And again, across from us is your home office. And then here's the vantage point from the front door. I'll step back a little bit so you can see from the front door all the way in through the house. You got a nice wide entrance here. Beautiful hardwood floors. You see all these accent beams. I'll give you a good view of that. You can see that all three openings here. Again, some nice touches you can do at the design center. This model, we will tour upstairs in a second, but this does have 
the bonus upstairs game room. You can do the bonus game room for about 30,000. Again, that price is always subject to change. So you definitely wanna check back with us for updating pricing on that. But uh, you could do the game room up there. You could also do an additional game room with bedroom and full bath upstairs for about 50,000. Here's bedroom number two. This is located in about the center portion of the house here. Again, you can see a good size, nice large bedroom, plenty of open space here. Again, another ensuite with full walk-in closet. So we'll take a peek here at the closet. Again, you can see you've got your built-in shelves, three levels of hanging racks, and then here we have another stand-up shower. Huge fan of Tradition Homes, one of my favorite builders here. In the Metroplex, we've got that floor-to-ceiling ceramic tile with that nice accent window up top just to bring some natural light into your bathroom. Here we have a powder bath. So if you are entertaining and you have some people over at the house here, they do not have to use one of the bathrooms in the bedrooms. You've got your powder bath there. Another closet with some built-in shelves. Nice solid, thick, cord, solid wood core doors there. And then as we move into the main living space of the house, you can see how just wide open and grand this view is here. Just give you a good kind of pan here. You've got your living area, your kitchen, open to your eating and what we call the hearth room or sitting room there with the additional fireplace. Here's your kitchen. You can see how big the kitchen is. Look how much counter space you have. This little peninsula sticking out here. Again, nice touches with the builder with the little storage there. We'll pan over here. You guys can see it's got the built-in mini fridge. We've got your upper cabinets within a second level of upper cabinets. You can see how large they are. Again, those are some of the upgrades you can do with the design center, beautiful backsplash. And then here with the model, you can see they've upgraded to some high-end appliances, this KitchenAid, six burner cooktop with the side griddle, the split ovens. You can see how much counter space they have here. Then let's take a peek at your pantry. Again, very, very important room. Everybody always asks to see in here. Full walk-in pantry. Custom shelves, again, currently being used by the builder as is just storage and some water, but that'll give you a good idea. And then you've got another bank of cabinets over here. You've got your counter depth refrigerator, your coffee station with your built-in microwave. And then your beautiful oversized island. Nice large pendants, kind of look like lampshades. Let me give you a spin through the kitchen so you can get that perspective of standing in your kitchen and then the view through the rest of the home. And 
And you can see how wide open this is. Look at the walking spaces, the separation of each room. You've got your double sliding glass door that leads outside. Very cool custom chandelier here. This model does have the first floor media room. I'll give you a spin from over here. I'm going to show you the media room as we spin around. Keep in mind straight ahead would be your three car tandem garage. So this would actually be closed off right now. Again, currently being used as your sales center, but take a look at this beautiful media room here with all the custom wood trim. Beautiful gold sconces. You can see how big this room is here. Lots of seating. You've got your double French door so you can close that off for some privacy. But plenty big for a media and entertaining room. As we flow back through the kitchen, you see you've got your dining area here, currently set up for eight, and you can see just how much room you do have all around. So you're definitely not squished in by any means, but just the sheer openness of this floor plan. Again, we're at 35, 3,600 square feet on one level. When you start adding the bonus room upstairs, that gets you to about 4,000 square feet. The bonus room and bedroom combo upstairs is gonna get you closer to 4,200 square feet. Here's your sitting room. They call it the hearth room with the fireplace. They've got your custom gas fireplace there with the beautiful stone Veneer, the finish with the cast. Look how beautiful that is. Nice, large gas fireplace. Just a great area to kind of kick back, relax. Have some drinks, read a book, sit by the fireplace. And then with these nice, large windows, letting in all this natural light. Look at the windows, look at the size of the windows that surround this room. Beautiful windows on each side of the fireplace. And then look at this huge bank of windows coming along here. And then here's the view from the back of the house all the way to the front. So you can see how nice and wide that entrance is. And then outside, we've got our double glass sliding doors opening up to a very large cover patio. Here we've got the fireplace with the mounted TV out there. As we move through, we'll head into the owner's suite. Here we've got a huge owner's suite. They've carried the hardwood floors through in the model. I don't know about you guys, but uh, let me know what you think about hardwood floors in the bedrooms. More specifically, what do you think about them in the, in the owner suite? I actually like carrying them through in the owner suite, not necessarily in some of the secondary bedrooms, but in the owner suite, I think it's a nice touch to, to do that. Now again, that's gonna be an upgrade, adding additional hardwood throughout, but something you may wanna consider. We've got the nice raised ceilings in here with this awesome chandelier. Let me get close to the bed. I wanna show you, they've got a kind of a brick veneer all along. So this entire wall along the headboard is that brick veneer. Ooh, it feels, 
Yeah, feels like brick. You got your sitting area. Look how big the room is, the depth of the room. Got three nice windows again, bringing in lots of natural light. Let's take a look at the owner's bath. This is not gonna disappoint. Look at the size, guys. Look how open this room is. You've got your standalone soaking tub, a really good size soaking tub. Oversized stand-up shower with the seating bench. And then look how big your countertops are, your split, your dual vanity. They're not split, it's on a single row, but look how much space you have. Beautiful finishes and touches here. We've got the dark, kind of espresso, dark brown tradition homes. Again, we absolutely love tradition homes. Take a look at the backsplash. That's that vertical stacked ceramic tile. And then you've got your block lights in here or block window, sorry, letting in some natural light. Just look how big and spacious this room is. And here's the utility room. Now, you may be asking, why is the utility room inside the master primary suite? Well, that's because again, remember this is a model home. So the way this set up is that wall in front of you will have a door opening again, so you can walk around. I believe that's an option there. So you can walk through that room into, uh, back to like where your garages are with the media room. And here is our walk-in closet. Look at the size of this walk-in closet with all the built-ins, three levels of hanging, all the different size shelves for storage. But what's nice about this model is it actually has a split closet. So two different closets. And this soaking tub is kind of that center point separating these two closets. Here is closet number two. Again, lots of storage with the custom built-ins. What do you guys think about this master bath? Is it impressive or what? And then let me give you the view. One of my favorite views is coming from the, the bath and then heading back into that master's suite here. And then that just view up to the ceilings, the chandelier. Awesome. Let's move back in to the main part of the house here and we'll head upstairs. Let me show you the bonus room as we move our way back through this. I mean, what an awesome room, just the, the openness of there. I've not really seen many model homes that feature that type of open concept. Okay, let's take a look at that bonus room. I like how they did all the wood stairs here. It's a nice upgrade and touch there. Very cool room. Put a ping pong table up here, foosball table, pool table. I love these little high bar stool tables, little serving tables with the custom bench all along that wall. Very cool design. And we've got, again, another powder bath up here. So if you are hanging out and entertaining upstairs, game room 
you can have a bath, which is nice. So again, a lot of flexibility with this room, a lot of customization that you can have here to kind of make this your own with a game room, additional bedrooms up here. And there you go. That's the actual model we're in right now. Very cool. That was good timing, huh guys? Well, let's head back downstairs. Let's talk a little bit more about Windsong Ranch, Tradition Homes, and what's going on here with pricing and availability. Hey guys, that concludes the interior tour. Now really quickly, I'm glad you stayed with me. I wanna to talk to you guys about discounts and incentives and about the home buying process for new construction. If you are interested in buying a new construction home, anywhere in DFW, but specifically here in Winsong Ranch or with Tradition Homes, make sure you connect with me. All my contact information is here. It's also below the video. Uh, we'll make sure we pop my number up here. Make sure you reach out to us, guys. Leverage the strength in my relationships, the strength of this YouTube channel and the relationships I have with builders and sales reps to make sure that we get you guys the best deal and incentives that are currently available. Now, we've got a list of all the builder incentives and discounts. You can click the link below. You can request our most recent incentive lifts. We do update that every 30 days. But buying new construction, there's a lot of things that go into it. And again, you want to make sure you're buying with the right builder in the right community. And you want to make sure you're getting the best incentives and deals that are possible. Make sure you guys connect with us. We'd love to help you find and buy that new construction home here in DFW. Now, if this is your first time to the channel, do me a favor, like today's video and subscribe. Make sure you click that little bell because that bell is gonna give you future notifications when we drop brand new model home tours just like this. And we are also gonna pop up here, whether it's up here or down below, one of these two next videos will be our most recent model home tour. Make sure you check that one out. That one just hit our YouTube channel. Uh, we appreciate you guys. Make sure you leave a comment. Let us know what you guys thought about this awesome home with Tradition Homes. We'll see you on the next model home tour. Take care, guys.